Can't stop, ain't stop, too hot. Came out like the daughter of Leah and Tupac. And I pop from the jump, ain't Hey babes, it's me, Kilakosh, back at it again with more Kilakon. And in this vlog, honeys, take a seat. We're gonna talk about my hair care. In this vlog, I'm just gonna be sharing a lot of my tips and tricks on how I maintain my hair because I've been bleaching for. Oh my god, I've been bleaching for almost one entire year now. It's honestly insane and completely toxic. <laughs> and definitely not something that I recommend to everyone that they should do, but pretty hurts, mother. It really hurts. <laughs> No, but for real though, I don't recommend it for so many reasons because it is one, expensive, two, a lot of maintenance, and three, toxic for your roots. But then listen, do I listen to myself? No, I'm that friend that when you tell advice, I just still follow my own instincts. So let's get into it. I went from blonde, then I made you guys vote pink or purple, and then you guys chose half pink and half purple on Twitter. So I did half pink and half purple, and then after that, I went full on pink. And next, I think I'm gonna go for a blue, but I'm not sure pa kung push ko yun or I'm gonna give up the hair color life because bitch, I'm tired. I am tired because it really is a lot of commitment. But okay, let's get into the FAQs. FAQs! So number one is what products do I use or what is my hair care routine? My hair care routine is pretty simple. Joke lang, it's not, bitch. So, it's actually really long and difficult. So, get a drink, take a seat, and sit back and relax. Number one is I don't shower every day. Yes, ang baho ko, ang baboy ko. Joke lang. I don't shower every day because not every single day I sweat ng todo naman. Like, if I don't work out, which is two times a week, I don't work out. I work out lang five times a week. I don't shower on those two days. I only really shower when I'm really sweaty and gross and really feel the need. Then on the other days, na hindi man na pawisan, I just like chilled in my room and stuff. I just do a half bath. So I just shower my body and then my hair I put up into a bun and then I make sure na hindi siya mababasa because that is one of the things that'll make the color fade faster. Second is that when I do shower, I don't put shampoo every single day. Probably only every other day and then every single day I use conditioner. So let me show you the products I use. None of this is sponsored by the way, so sana actually must sponsor ako mahal. Sana lang, please. When I do shampoo, this is what I use. It's the Kerastase Genesis line. It is a anti-hair fall fortifying shampoo for weakened hair prone to falling due to breakage. My heart. Check out. I use this because yun nga, it's prone to falling due to breakage. My hair, after being colored so much and bleached so much, it's really, really weak. But it actually still looks healthy. What you can tell if your hair is still healthy or if it's dead is if you put it up like this and hindi siya mag bend. If hindi siya mag bend, that means it's dead. And if ganda siya, medyo may buhay pa siya. Because it is kind of bending, pero a little stiff. But it's bending, so it's still alive, dao. Dao. I'm not like a hair specialist or beautician or anything. Pero nakita ko yun sa TikTok, and you know, TikTok's the encyclopedia nowadays. So, pero buhay pa naman siya. It, it still curls, it still bends, but you can't really avoid the breakage or hair fall. Like you'll find my hair all around my house, like mother confetti around my house. I'm not kidding. I use the shampoo. This is like 2.5, 2.7. Parang ganun. Nasa 2K plus and sobrang mahal niya. But this is my second time to buy na and I'm almost halfway because I really like the effect. Like I literally just dyed my hair less than a month ago and the roots are super growing na. Like, that's half an inch. Like my roots grew half an inch in less than a month. So, mabilis talaga maggrow yung hair ko because of my routine which I'm really happy about. So, this shampoo really helps strengthen the hair bonds and make sure that it doesn't break as often. I mean, nagbe break pa rin siya pero not that bad. I shampoo probably on average three times a week because I don't shampoo every day. So, it really helps. I definitely recommend buying this but if you're on a budget, use a sulfate free shampoo because sulfate will dry out your hair and remove the color really fast. So, sayang lang yung hours na pinaghirapan mo to achieve your color, to bleach and achieve your color. Kung wala yung shampoo mo yun, matatanggal lang din. When I condition my hair, I use a hair mask as a conditioner. So, I don't know if this is like healthy or right, but I mean, I use this from L'Oreal Professional. It's the B6 plus biotin. It's a strengthening anti-breakage mask. So, yun nga, it really strengthens your bonds so that your hair doesn't fall apart so fast and make sure that the bonds are strong. 
you really have to invest in products that will sustain your hair if this is something that you commit to doing. Because it's a TBH, so commitment niya. Like it's an everyday kind of thing, girl. Ang hirap. It is so tiring. So f tiring. I can't even. Yeah. I'm using conditioner. I use a hair mask because it is stronger, and then I use it as conditioner, as in every day. To but I, again, I don't shower every day, so about five times a week I use this conditioner, and it's the bomb.com. Actually, konti nang alang din. Medyo mahal din siya, but again, it's an investment. Unless you want to go bald, well, I'm not hating on people who are bald, but like yung yeah, I don't really want to go bald, so boodle gaming. Next, what I do is, I don't just use this alone. I mix it with a little of this Hair Paint Manila Purple Conditioner. This purple conditioner is for bleach or blonde color treated hair with anti-brass solution that activates, neutralizes orange and yellow tones. So if you notice with me is my hair color pretty much stays. Yes, it fades like over the past few weeks, over the past few months. It was like a darker pink. Um, right now, it's like many different shades of pink. Like, some, if you look at it, are more um, flamingo. Some are a hotter pink, darker pink, but overall it like meshes well together. And the reason it doesn't fade out into an orange tone, because normally pink nagiging orange or coppery tone tries because I mix the mask with a little of the purple conditioner. So parang at least sabay sabay na siya, like two birds with one stone. And then this is the mask talaga that I invested in. It's the Olaplex Hair Perfector number no. three. And ito mahal talaga siya. And it's really worth it. Like out of all the things that I purchased, this is the number one that I really recommend that you buy. So many celebrities use this, other influencers use this. Literally every week I leave this on in my hair and I wear a shower cap. And then it says leave on for a minimum of 10 minutes. Pero for me dahil Repot ako. I leave it on for a solid hour, as in one whole hour just soaking it in every week. And I wash it off with cold water, and it's so good for you. My hair feels young again. Young again. It feels like virgin hair again. Like, I feel like Olaplex is one of the biggest reasons why my hair is still alive and healthy. If you add it all up, like, it's really at least minimum of 4K a month. And because I have long hair. So you use more product. It really costs a lot. And for me, kasi if you decide to have bleached and colored hair, invest talaga in the right products para hindi masasayang yung hair mo. Sayang yung roots mo, yung bonds, lahat na. Because if you're not gonna invest in, in the right products, you're just gonna be doing yourself dirty. So when you do decide to commit to this, save up din muna for the right products because I don't want y'all to burn your roots and die. And on top of all of that, I sleep with a towel over my pillow every single night because what I use, as you guys know, is a paint pot. I didn't use a permanent color. So what that means is that slowly, it's going to rub off. Siya, which happens with even with permanent color, right? But with paint pot, it, it fades a lot faster. And ako, diba, I have white bed sheets, so sayang. And sprak yung yaya namin sa akin because I always have so much pink everywhere. It colors my sheets, my shirts. Like, if you check the hoodie, there's a pink stain all the time down there. And it is inevitable talaga. Pero I noticed, nung purple yung kabilang side ko, walang stain. So I think it's just this pink color talaga na nag-sustain. A lot of maintenance, not just for your hair, but for your beddings, your towels, your clothes. Or, always dry your hair before you sleep or before you wear anything. I'm always in like a tube top and then I'm drying my hair. So, medyo nakakapagod siya na every night I dry my hair before I sleep. Bawal matulog talaga na basa yung boko or else mag-sustain sa lahat, girl. What the f***? Oh my god, you guys. I just realized I have these marks on my nose from wearing glasses all day. Oh, sorry. And for everyone asking about my glasses, this is the Dex from Sunny Studios. I just ordered it online. One of the things that I do to maintain my gorgeous locks is that I use castor oil, aloe vera, and coconut oil. So castor oil is often used to grow your brows, to buy in your eyelashes. So I thought, why not put it on my roots then or in my hair? The con of that is yun nga, it's gonna grow out fast and your roots are gonna be seen super fast. Pero I'd prefer that and then just maintain rather than slow hair growth, nothing's happening, waiting for nothing. So what I do is I get this little spray bottle which is basically almost 
empty na. I want to show you guys talaga eh. First, I get coconut oil. There's so much coconut oil here in Manila. You can get it on Shopee Lazada. Pero this one kasi, I got it for free at an event. So it's what I've just been using lately. And then I fill it up. Maybe like still there. This is the only castor oil I have. It's for my lashes kasi. You can also apply this to your lashes for faster growth and on your brows and on your roots. Lahat na. So, what I do na lang is pour some of it into the container. The coconut oil really helps hydrate my hair. I know a lot of people also use argan oil, Moroccan oil, because what happens with your hair is it super dries up from the bleach. So what you want to do is hydrate it. Again, I'm not like a beautician or anything of that sort, so I don't know if this is 100% okay. Correct me if I'm wrong, but it's what I've been doing to keep my hair healthy. Have a huge aloe plant. We used to sell them on the good home but i cut up a little piece i love aloe vera you can use this for almost anything you can use it for your hair for your drinks like i love putting aloe vera in my cocktails in my morning tea and then what you do is i basically just open up the aloe vera aloe vera is also really good for hair growth i learned this from my mom because when she got pregnant though or after she got pregnant she had a really hard time growing her hair back, like her hair was falling out. She would put aloe vera directly on her hair and it would really help her hair growth. Even when I used to not have bleached hair, I would just have like brown hair and stuff like that and get a lot of coloring done. I don't know if you guys have been following me since then, but I used to get my hair done almost every two months. Like just retouching my hair, bleaching, highlights, and all these things. Doing all that to your hair is fun, siempre, pero there are always negative effects, diba? Like you can't do too much of it. So I've been doing this for years. And like I have some on my hands. We're just gonna like put it on my head now because I didn't want the treatment. But if you don't have an aloe vera plant, and this is what I do, then I mix the real aloe vera with this soothing aloe vera gel. It's 99.85%. It's paraben, alcohol free, and no, and no artificial color. This is from Lux Organics, but the face shop has and so many others have. And I get some that and then I just slide it in there. Sorry if this is like a little messy. It's literally 1 a.m. and I decided to shoot this. Another thing, yes, another thing that a lot of people also tell me, but if you're into swimming or if you guys have a pool or you live near a beach, ideally you really don't get your hair wet eh, para mag stay talaga yung color. The more you get your hair wet, the faster it is. So I guess just don't shower. Wag na lang tayo maligo. Potal. Quarantine naman, walang makakakita sa'yo. Joke lang. There you have it. I basically, I just did like a third of the container. Because if I fill this up, ang tagal. Magkakat cut pa ako ng aloe vera. Bukas na tayo magkatapo. Just shake it off, and then you'll have this like, icky looking consistency. And then you just spray it on. Spray it on your roots. So I do this almost every day. Yeah, I'm to shoot. Like nobody's really gonna see me na man. Oh, and something I also want to share. If you already have pretty thin hair, I. Ideally, you don't put yourself through this because you don't put your hair mo. I know my hair looks pretty healthy. If you look at it, like it's still super thick. Before, it used to be like that. Hello. So, yeah, you just keep spraying all over. And I do this regularly naman. So, another thing I like to do, well, that my mom does, directly from the aloe vera, she like slices it open like that. And then just like directly like swipes it on like that. So you could always do that too if you don't want to mix up the solution and then put the castor oil and then put the coconut oil. But for me, because it's most convenient to just put it all in one bottle. Another thing that really helped me maintain my hair is constantly combing my hair and not brushing it. Because brushing is normally kind of blunt. Oh my god, I look so gross right now. Masyadong intense means sa yung pag pag mag brush ka and it just breaks the hair apart. So use. A comb, slowly brush your hair, para, especially when there are tangles. Make sure that you don't just spray it on the roots, but on the ends of your hair as well. Anyway, so there you have it, you guys. That is my overall hair care routine. Some tips and tricks and my special solution that is not so special. I'm sure a lot of people do this then, but maybe you guys didn't know. That's why you guys keep asking me. So I hope this helped. And if you have any more questions, comment down below so I can answer them maybe in like a hair care Q&A. Don't forget to like, subscribe if you enjoyed, and follow me on TikTok. Please, guys. I'm effort to Please.
And for the giveaway, what I'm giving away is a very special Olaplex number three. So I have one extra bottle that I might not be using anymore if I decide to go back to dark. So I'm deciding on giving it away. So all you have to do is like, subscribe, comment down below, follow me on TikTok, and share any of my TikTok videos. And you have the chance to win an Olaplex number three. So that I could help you guys out if you decide to color your hair. So there you have it. Thank you guys so much for watching. And we'll see you next time. Bye! Oh, 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 oh,